Alright dudes and dudettes, welcome back to another episode of Project Ozone 3 here with Super Turtle. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day, because I sure am, and guys, we're in a blood moon again, and it's terrifying. Hey, well, look at that, we got another meteor coming in. That's so cool looking, I think it's from Astro Sorcery, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, so today, guys, we need to work on getting this, uh, this water out of this wooden crucible here, so we can start making some clay, and to do that, we're going to go ahead and make this crushing table. Uh, but first we need to go ahead and do it. And the reason we're doing this is because if we look at the bucket recipe, it is stupid. They want these iron plates and we can get it by doing this. So we're going to go ahead and get one of these rolling. So here we go. We got our crushing table. We're gonna grab our iron hammer and bada bing, bada boom. We got it. Okay. So we're going to put this, I will just put this like right here. And I just realized that we need to expand out this way one more block. It's not perfectly square. It's going to throw me off. Okay, so I got a whole bunch of iron up here. Oops, I just threw it on the ground. And so it's like this, right? All right, there we go. And let's go ahead and make two buckets. Boom, we got two buckets. So grab this water, grab the water again. And we're going to make an infinite water source over here. So that way, yeah, we'll just do a normal two by two. We don't have to worry about water ever again. Perfect, so now we have water. All right, now, to, now that we have water, we can go ahead and let's make sure not all of this smelts up. Because we're gonna get some clay going because we're gonna get some lava production and yay, lava. Woohoo. So good. Okay, uh, I need to get rid of the these guys. Otherwise, I'm gonna click and it's gonna be really bad for all of us. Mainly just me, but it's okay. You you'll feel it too. It'll save your face from being face palmed. Yeah, that's that's how we're gonna justify it. Okay, so we're just gonna build this out. We're making deuced. Making a deuced. Oh oh no 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 no. Rip. Uh, my ear itches. Sorry, I had to itch it. Go like this and just like click really fast. Okay, wait for it. Hello, take you, come again. All right. Boom, boom, oh, missed. Boom, 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 boom. There we go. Sound like something you hear from like Willy Wonka. All right. Okay, and we're gonna smack it. Good, so now we have dust. All right, now that should have completed a quest, right? We did the flint mesh, let's go ahead and claim that. Um, oh, we need two clay, okay, not bad. Boom, let's go ahead and detect. Claim. Ta-da! Yeah! Water to clay. Alright, um... we get any bone meal? Can you get bone meal from something? Let's see. Yes. Oh, you have to sift dust. Okay. So, we got some dust. Let's go ahead and sift it up some. Hopefully we get a few. But jeweled, we got quartz, so we have five. Ah, it's just not enough. We need more than five. We need like more. Okay, boom. Hopefully we can get two within this 10. Mm, I don't know. Oh, yes. Perfect. The perfect amount. Okay. Go ahead and place these down. Break them. All right. And, ooh, Ender.io conduits. Interesting. So in order to make a, let's see here. We need to make a lava generation. So you need to make a crucible. In order to make a crucible, get that in my inventory. I'll get that out of there. You need to take clay, bone meal, make unfired porcelain. Then you craft this up like a... Uh, cauldron and there you go unfired crucible and you come here and then you fire it up and you light it up 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 light it up 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 because it's on fire and 
That was very loud, but uh, we're out of food. Just kidding, we have a bunch of rock candy that we can start chewing on. So nothing to fear, fear not. Awesome, but we have this. Okay, so let's grab a torch for now. And lava generation, let's go ahead and claim it. All right, so lava processing. So it says blaze quartz, 10 times as fast. Delorium blocks are 20 times. Blaze mesh is 30. Plutonium is 40. Ludicrite is 60. Heat sand is 120. We can find that in the nether, actually. And then awakened draconium is 480 times. Yeah. So that's good. We can actually start to make a cobblestone generator now. So let's go ahead. We're just going to put this here. Put that there. We need some cobblestone. And what the crucible does is it converts... Uh, cobblestone with uh, like a heat source below it, so a torch in the assistance. Uh, it converts that to lava, if that makes any sense. So now that we got some cobble, let's go ahead and you'll see that if we go like this, cobblestone in there, uh, torches are only a rate times one, so it's very slow. But as you can see, just below, it's like right here, it says solid cobblestone at 980. Uh, 979, 978 going down. Liquid lava is 28, 29, 30. So it's going up. It's slow, uh, but it's going up. And we need that to get to 1,000. So I'm going to let this go for quite a while. We're going to get our bucket, which is why we made two of these. And we're going to make ourselves a cobblestone generator. Sweet. So the cobblestone, or the lava, sorry, is now finished. So let's go ahead and grab a bucket of it, like so. Let's go ahead and grab a bucket of water, and we just got done smelting up a piece of glass. Perfect. So let's go ahead and make a cobblestone generator, just like so, and we get to save both buckets. Awesome. So what this does is if, here, let me craft up a, um, we need a chest like this. Let me craft up a drawer. So if we take a storage area, a normal chest would work with this. Uh, oops. Here, let's go like this. We're getting two of them. Uh, this, if if you have a like a storage area up top, it will disperse cobblestone to it. Uh, so very cool. Uh, we can also ooh, we're gonna actually upgrade this right now. I don't have a pickaxe to mine that. I did a lot, of, or not a lot of work, but some work off camera. There we go. We got a pickaxe. Oh yay! There we go. I was like, can I not pick you up? But we're good. All right, so if we do this, if we surround it in iron, we're gonna get an achievement, or we should. Yep, and this will do it uh, twice as fast. So let's go ahead and claim these bad boys. And then we can surround it with diamonds and it'll be better than that. Uh, we can also upgrade our flint mesh to iron mesh now. We can also make some carrot carrots, uh, auto sifter. There's only one Chance of auto sifter, which are these? It's a, uh, it's very uh, not good. It's not good at all. It's stupid. <laughs> I'm not a fan of it. The other sifters are so much betterer, and I just made up a word just to describe how much betterer they are. Okay, so go ahead and put our cobblestone in there. So as you can see, that number is slightly going up. It's right around here. It says time two times sixty four plus twenty twenty one. So that's how fast we're getting cobblestone. It's doing it all on its own. So now we don't have to do any more of this. So I'm super happy. Let's go ahead and that worked. Okay. Let's see, we have enough of these to actually go ahead. So we're gonna make two, oh, iron plates. I forgot about those. We're actually gonna go ahead and upgrade these chests over here. There we go. Let's go ahead and make up a new chest. Like this one, and then we're just gonna throw the iron around here. If you do it like this, uh, you don't have to um, waste the wood, but if uh, you already have, say, a chest down. It would be better to do this. That way it doesn't waste all the items. So now we basically have four chests within this two now because it doubles the space, and then it goes up after that with gold. Go ahead and get this gold smelting. Go and get this gold smelting. All right, so we got 50 rack. What can we do with 50 rack? Let's have a look. Rewards. Greater loot, 20. 
Epic loot, 40. Let's, uh, let's get a loot chest. All right. And this kit. Uh, okay. Upgrades emerald furnaces to end this furnace. Ah. Uh, ah, uh, that wasn't that good. I shouldn't have done it. <laughs> Instant regret. Oh, well, uh, let's get rid of all this stuff. Actually, no, we can, if I'm not mistaken, go like this. Yeah, with Draconic Evolution, you can put stuff on the side. So we're going to do that with this, so that way we, we don't ever have to, like, worry. We just keep it here all the time. So if you ever have to make any plates, we are solid. Okay. All right, so I would like to make an all-in-one tool, which requires one of each weapon thing. Uh, we're going to need a shovel, too, and a sword. Whoops. All right, and if we go to uses, we should see it here pretty soon. Yep, here's the Ayat, like so. Oh, we gotta make a new pickaxe. Shouldn't have wasted the old one. Oh well, let's see here, uses. Hoping this would be faster than the other one, but it seems to be just as long, if not longer. Perfect, so now we have a tool. Now this will act like a hoe, a axe, a pickaxe, a sword. So it's like an all-in-one. So anything you can think of, even a shovel, it'll all be the same. That's what the little thing is up top, it's a shovel. So now we can start moving some stuff, which is cool. Uh, let's just grab these guys, we're gonna move. I'm gonna move this, we're gonna put it over here. Uh, yeah, like that. And then we'll take the hammer and go, uh, bink. You have to configure that in your file, by the way, if you didn't know. Uh, we need some more cobble for this guy. So it's four for, a, I guess, a full bucket of iron. Or right, anyway, we're going to, because, is this a... No, oh, it's not. Okay, so we can go here and sleep. Perfect. Yay. Could you imagine if you could craft while you were in bed? You know how funny it would be? It'd be like crafting in bed. That, that joke was a lot funnier in my head, I promise. Okay, so let's go ahead and make some rock candy up. Like this, and like this. Boom. And we're going to go toward the... Oops. The nether. <laughs> you guys are probably like, he just jumped off the edge. What are you doing? This is how you get to the nether in this mod pack. You can't make a portal. Actually, you can make a portal, but it's random whenever you land in this. And I just remembered I didn't do slash set home. So if we land in lava, we're screwed. So we haven't loaded in yet. Oh, we're screwed. Yep. Oh, we are fire resistant. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha Screw you! Check it out, we can see under here. Interesting. There's some berries over there. You know, cool be if there are like lava sharks in this? I think it'd be pretty funny. I am so glad that we are fire resistant. That's so awesome. If we can just come under here and we can like, not have to worry about gas shooting at us because the lava's between us. Hmm. Oh, but you do suffocate. Or drown, sorry, not suffocate, okay. Come on. Oh boy, okay. So we need to find some of that Bernie sand. Butcher said he was able to find it. And it's like, hey. Butcher was able to find it. It did, it did take him a while, but like we should be able to find it too. Where are you? Well, hi! I'm on fire. You're dead. That's the first thing we've killed. I feel successful. Um, salamander. I think those hurt, though. Magma cube. Okay, there we go. Bernie, Bernie is gone. Okay. Uh, there's a lot of soul sand, if I do remember. Yeah. And these salamanders, if you make them angry, they are not very happy with you. So we're not going to do that. Uh, da, 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 da. You know, I figured since the burning sand looks like this place, I figured it would, uh, you know, be here. 
but I guess not. No, I don't see it. Hmm. Let's have a look here. Actually, let's just type in sand. Because I don't remember exactly what it was called. Heat sand. I mean, it does look like that. Pretty close. So let's go up into this nether fortress. I'll meet you guys when I'm up at the top. This is going to take a while. Okay, we've made landfall. And... Uh, looks pretty spooky. It's pretty spooky, yeah. That's not burning sand. I'm really looking for that burning sand because it'll bake our lava production like 120 times, and I'm happy. Uh, so let me see if I can mark this. Nope, that's not how you do it. Uh, is it J? Yes. We're going to put a waypoint here uh, called Enter... That's not how you spell entrance. I don't care. This is a slime chunk. Oh, snap. <gasps> not what I wanted to do. Graves dust, interesting. We got wither skull fragments, wither bone, wither ash. We're set. Okay, I'm just gonna vein my nose. Yes, we can. And I'm gonna. It is very dark. Ooh, chesticle. Nether wart, friend of pearl, gold ingot. Okay. Probably should have brought more torches. Well, this is interesting. Yeah. Yeah, now he can't come get me. Haha. <laughs> a dude close. I just know it. Hmm. There's a zombert pig man -o. I'm getting blown up in a chat. I'm sorry. We'll make it better. There we go. Okay. Heat sand, heat sand, heat sand. Where do I remember seeing that? I don't know. Let's just run through this place like we're speed running a video game. I wonder if you have to hit slash spawn to get home. It really sucked because I didn't really think this through. <gasps> Chest. Dimlet, cool. Got some more gold. That's always good at this point in the game. Okay. Do, 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 do. DC so spooky. Oh my goodness. Hey, get out of here. I'm a pro Minecraft player. You can't come and hit me like that, boy. Boy, I tell you what. Well, that's a spooky looking tree. It's got fire on it. Hmm. Run! We got slow. Don't touch those spiky things. They hurt. Um, is that the heat sand? Oh, that is the heat sand. We found it. Yay! It's only taken us like... <gasps> ow. <laughs> like, ow. I might die as soon as I get here. Oh, man. There's a blaze between here and there. Okay, we just gotta go. Hopefully he's not mad anymore. Are you salty anymore? Stop being salty. I'm shifting. You can't see me. Yeah, see? He's like, I don't know. I don't know what you're talking about, man. 
I have vein miner. What am I doing? Oh well, I'm gonna keep doing it. Oh, there's more. We're vein mining this. Yeah. What was that noise? That was spooky. That noise not that spooky. Harvest level cobalt. Look at that. That thing is the spinning thing of death. Oh no, it's the demon sheep. They hate me. They want me dead. I accidentally killed one of their friends and they're just like, ah, I'm gonna kill you. Run away. Okay. Let's see, so we hit slash spawn. Do we go back? Oh, not that one. Oh boy. Oh, it says we're teleporting, okay. Whew. That could have been bad. I didn't I didn't have an idea of how to get back if that didn't work. So I'm glad that worked. Watch well, us now just fall into a void. That'd be funny as heck. Nope, we're okay. We're okay. So we'll get rid of you. And we're gonna put one of you down. Look at that, we already got a bucket. We already got half a bucket. That's fast. Two buckets, two and a half, three buckets, three and a half, four buckets. <laughs> I mean, this thing this is amazing. Thanks for putting that in the game, guys. Okay, so we had some fun today. Let me see how much time we got left in the video, and we'll see if we can do any more, more fun stuff. All right, guys, so unfortunately, we are out of time for today's episode. We had some fun exploring the nether today. We also got to uh, set up our crucible. We got some water going. We got a cobblestone generator. So, guys, I hope you did enjoy the, day, the video today. Oh, we got that thing over there, too. But anyways, I hope you have a great day. I'll see you all in the next one. Take care, everyone. Bye-bye.